Hey guys, it's Xavier from Kingship Digital. Today I'm going to be demonstrating how to set up custom fields for outbound posts, which could be used for your general social updates, as well as also responding from one of your various social accounts. So to initially create a custom field, we would from our social core desktop search for settings and click on the custom fields icon located here. So this is our custom field dashboard. For this demonstration, I'm going to create a content theme custom field and I will also showcase a pre-completed post type custom field as well. So to create a custom field, we would go to the top right of the screen and click under add custom field. We would generally either select pick list for individual or pick list multi-select for multiple content themes. We would then fill in basic information starting with the name which would be content theme. We would then move on to the description. And now under assets, so assets is which area in Sprinkler we want this custom field to appear and be used. We are going to choose outbound message for this particular custom field. Now under set values, so the values are the options that are going to appear in our pick list custom field. We are now going to enter the content themes that we want the users to choose when publishing a new post, such as digital transformation. customer experience, marketing, social media, sprinkler, just as an example. And we would sort them from A to Z. Now under advanced visibility filters, our criteria would be a visibility based on other custom field and its value. Under select custom field, we would select campaigns and under select values of custom field we would select proactive publishing. Now under asset level configuration we would select the asset types to define configuration for our new custom field which would be outbound message and then we would tick include as part of filtering and tick include as part of a universal search. Now before we click save, it's important to note that once you have created a custom field, it cannot actually be deleted, it can only be disabled. So we would now save. So now to find our newly created custom field, we would simply go through filters, click under pick list and outbound message, and here is our content theme. And we can view in details as so. Now going back, we would simply go back to custom fields, deselect our filters and now to showcase our post type custom field we would simply go down here and select on details and you can scroll through as so. So now we're going to select P to open up create post fill in your relevant details under accounts and content after the campaign is chosen which is actually automatically done for you here as you can see proactive publishing you will see the custom fields, post type and content theme. For content theme we're going to select customer experience and for post type we'll select blog. And this is so that we can report on the effectiveness of these posts. So the benefits of custom fields is that it provides more insights into certain types of content allowing user teams to drill down further in terms of reporting to understand what drives engagement and other use cases they are interested in. So that's it for now. Of course, if you'd like to learn anything more about this particular feature or any other features on the platform, feel free to get in touch with us here at Kingship Digital by following the link below to our website. Also, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you all next time. Cheers, guys.